I remember the Kartoba, an island in a dune sea. I remember the guide stone, the diamond shoals, the sisters of Balcora spinning a hundred billion stars, the song of the core. I remember opening the gates. Was it so long ago? No, not so long. But not long enough.
Attacking sector. One of the enemy missile frigates is isolated. Use the resource controller to capture. Collection underway. Just like what you'll find in the real world. Except each loss becomes a lesson for your next deployment. We're hit. Carrier down. But you don't have to fight alone. Combat mission set. Protect each other. We need cover. Moving to guard. We're on our way. Copy on redirect. Secure the objectives. Target set. We're inbound. Push through. Give our people an opening. Sweep around. Move complete. Win as a united fleet. Hostile eliminated. Each victory will grant you experience points to unlock artifacts and available starting fleets. New powers mean new paths to victory. Upgrade complete. Ships will become stronger, even a little unique. Threat detected. Let's move. Fail a mission, and your fleet restarts at square one. Get us out of here. Carry her down. But you can't rely on just one strategy. Torpedo frigate deploying. Start the run. Roll in. Let's move. Threat marked. Targeting to AG. You see? You just had to change your approach. Action successful. Power to engine. The enemy is cunning and will adapt to overwhelm you. Hold steady, I'm coming around. Direct hit. We will lock. Light him up. Keep him guessing. I'm locked out. Taking fire. Learn. What? What? Adapt. Good shot. Leverage all your experience to achieve victory. This is where commanders are made. The entire life has been study, analysis, planning. Today, the galaxy is burning. I will be bound into the Carcassonne. Merged with the ship in both body and mind. Fleetwide comms open. Attention all personnel. You've each just received a mission briefing. Nothing is redacted, because I want you to know what is at stake. We have been tasked with finishing Karen Sajet and the Fifth Fleet's mission. Discover the source of the anomaly. And stop it once and for all. I know we were expecting a simple shakedown cruise. Proximity alert. Control enemy strike craft weapons. Many of you are feeling overwhelmed. Doubting yourselves. Confirmed. We've got incoming. Ask yourselves this fleet. Who would follow a course laid by doubt? Would we already have the finest navigator of our generation? I have no doubt. We will succeed. Whatever it takes to complete the mission. My name is Imogen Sajet. Now, I must be more than a scientist. I am Fleet Command. The barren desert planet of Karak. Home to a resilient but divided people known as the Kushan. They fought over resources under a burning sun for thousands of years. Everything changed when Rachel Sajet discovered something buried deep beneath the unforgiving sands. An ancient technology that would allow the Kushan to escape their dying world. A hyperspace core. And with it, 
a map that pointed the way to the true home of the Kushan, Higara. The Kushan put aside their differences and for 100 years worked together to construct a grand mothership that could transport 600,000 Kushan to Higara. Karen Sajet, Rachel's descendant, volunteered to be bound body and mind to the mothership and become its navigator and fleet command. But the efforts of the Kushan did not go unnoticed. The Taidan Empire, a powerful enemy who had exiled the Kushan to Karak 4,000 years ago, took swift and devastating action. While Karak burned, Karen rescued all that remained of her people. But instead of fleeing into the dark, Karen turned the mothership into the tip of a spear, a spear aimed directly at Higara. In the war that ensued thereafter, Karen's fleet emerged victorious. The Taidan Empire was shattered, and the Kushan reclaimed their homeworld, becoming Higarans once more. Just as Rachel discovered a hyperspace core, Karen learned of the existence of two others. The first of these was gifted to Karen by the Bentusi, an ancient race who called no planet home and lived only among the stars. The final core was won by Karen upon defeating the Vagir, a vicious foe who sought to control the cores at any cost. Karen united all three cores aboard the legendary progenitor mothership Sajuk. And in doing so, unlocked a vast hyperspace gate network, enabling interstellar travel for all. Trade and culture spread effortlessly between the stars. Population centers grew in places previously inaccessible, and the galaxy was united in peace. Thus began the Age of Sujet. But deep in the Outer Rim lurked a region of space from which no ship ever returned. It became known as the Anomaly. Gates in this area were erratic and dangerous. Thousands of lives were lost. Eventually, these gates went completely dark, and the Anomaly spread. Karen Sajet, aboard a new mothership called the Car Sajuk, was sent to find the source of the anomaly and stop it. She never returned. Twenty years later, the burden falls to Karen's protege, Imogen Sajet.